Hello and welcome back. The track is back as well. Watch what we've done. I don't know why I'm always saying we because there's only bloody me building it, but the track is back and better than ever. So, quick city update. I have put the train track back on, but I've done it as an elevated. Now, I appreciate the single posts probably won't hold it too long, but at the same time, it's strong enough at the moment. I have just been playing with my train. So if I put this on here, it works. It doesn't wobble. Now, you may notice, okay, we've got the track, but I've got the construction crew on each end working on building a train station. So what I'm looking at doing is if I can build an elevated train station on each end, I've got power pack coming. It will be my first battery operated stuff in this city, other than obviously the little twist on lights that came with the coffee shop, which I've put into the aquarium. But my first motor is coming. So we have all the construction crew under here, blocked off the area, got their little hut. He's just ran into the crane, but yeah, I've made it so it looks like they're laying down tile on the top, even though all the tile is already done. The fire station has been moved over to this side. Reason being, instead of having it down there, I've left all of this part open so that I could put the elevated train track and then I'm also going to look at um, trying to like pave it or something. Or what I might even end up doing, I haven't quite decided yet, is when I've put all the road plates down, which hopefully are coming today, these are six studs away from the edge of this base plate. But the problem is, if I need to take that base plate away, that train track's attached to it. So once the road plates are on, they're only going to lose one stud on each end just to clip it to start with. So I'm thinking maybe the next stud in could be where the track goes. But then that means moving it, what, two, four, to moving it into six places. So, yeah, I might get away with it having the track over here, have the train station possibly coming around. That's the only thing I haven't figured out yet because obviously if the train station's here, you can't get onto the train there. It's got to get on from the side. So I might build the train station coming up this way so that you can get onto the platform. Same down here. If it moves over slightly, then it's not a massive problem. I can build the train station so it's here or maybe on that plate instead and then they can get on. I'm still in the process of working that out. I'm just happy I've got the track done. I've even got a little advert board on the track. We've still got our wonderful Asda store. You've seen that in previous videos. I've just put these on as a roof. I might just leave the roof off because it looks a bit better. You can actually see inside a lot more activity. Plus, I could always do with extra plates. Uh, we've got a load of activity outside. Obviously, we've got the trolley bay. I have got a trolley coming. We've got a new modular. Each section comes apart. There is nothing inside any of them at the moment. I'm working on exteriors. Eventually, once the city's looking a lot better and I can see what I've got part-wise, I can do interiors. So, no interior, no interior, no interior. Comes as comes as again hospital no interior the police station i did do it <laughs> oops anyway same with asda i've done an interior on that same with uh mcdonald's and kfc even though they could probably do a bit better We've got aquarium that looks epic and then these have all got interiors as well you know that one i followed lego instructions using parts that i have available and it's apart from the last video that I did. Uh, I mean, this one, you've got like a little living room going on. Ooh. 
seem to have knocked a part off. So yeah, we've got the living room there. So we're working on that anyway. So, where was we? Train stations, Asda, right. So that's the new modular. I don't know if it's a hotel, offices, either way, looks cool. I tried to do the bottom to look a bit different. We've got a bit of greenery. Fire station, absolutely love it now. Not massively keen on how far back the pavements go, but again, I could always take some of this away, put like a fountain here or something like that later on. We've got the jewellery shop. Again, that's dropped back because it's the same level as the fire station, but that could possibly be brought forward or I could do like a little diorama here. Palace Theatre is still in the same place, as are all these, the Lego Avengers Tower. Love my little adaptation to make it all blend in because that is ugly as hell. My police station down here as well. Notice we've got helicopter pads on all the tops of those and then we've got the shuttle on the top of there. These have been moved over to this side because of how tall they are. When I have it here, I keep knocking into it trying to reach this corner. That base plate will be millsed and... Uh, turned into a road pretty much like I've done here so that will have the tunnel going in that tunnel will eventually get done as well over in the theme park area it's not massive I will be doing a lot more work with it for the first time ever I've tried to do um, increased mills how do you call it elevated mills so I'm trying to give it a bit of depth so I've just got to blend all that in obviously do a lot more work on that. I'm just trying to do one piece at a time. Then we, again, we've got the construction area. We've got the basketball court, the skate park. This is just like a little pool or reservoir. I don't know why I've put those in there. It's not big enough to do anything in there. <laughs> you know, you ain't got much space. But I barricaded it all off except for this little entry bit here and then that will be paved. This is obviously where the bus will turn around. The roads will make a lot more sense when they arrive. So again, you've seen the aquarium, McDonald's. We've got uh, the pet shop, the sh uh, convenience shop, as well as like a little flat on top. Nothing has changed with the rock stage other than the fact I've got to attach that down and make an entry to it. Then I'm not going to bother mills in this either. So I'm going to make a step possibly that comes out to the other side. The hotel muck that me and Courtney built so it looks over the sea. We've got the TARDIS I got off Timu and I've just put a police sign on it just to finish it off because it looks a bit bare. The police sign's not working. You can see where I've peeled it off the other piece to put onto there. And nothing has changed over in the beach area. I've increased the market a bit because I found a load of parts that I'd put away. So, we have still got a lot of work to do. Uh, we've got the bank, the beauty shop, the Lego store here. I've moved the high school over to here. We've got these temporarily placed. So we've got that Avengers compound and that Avengers compound. But again, we've got Avengers Tower there. Don't know quite what I'm going to do with those. Might put it as a big muck like I had before. The only problem is if I have a big building, where am I going to put it? I'm running out of space. Plus, I want the train track to work, so I need some sort of space at the front as well. I can't just have a great big building there and then a track right in front of it because it just looks stupid. I've been playing with the idea of elevating the back even got these 56p for four i was buzzing i was like yeah i'm having those but again that isn't set into motion anytime soon we've got wall we've got the uh, wiring we've got shelves we've got um gas meter you know it's just not ideal for the elevation really also got the airport command tower over there Again, I don't know what I'm going to do with that. I need some sort of display space for all my ships because at the moment they're all just dumped on a shelf. 
even got the old train bridge. So that might be taken apart and put into using for the uh, train station so you can go up the stairs to the train station. So this is where we're standing at the moment anyway. Hopefully it's uh, been improved as it comes along or you lot think it is anyway. So let me know in the comments down below what do you think I should work on next? What ideas have you got that I could do here that would help? Let me know. If there's any more improvements, keeping in mind I'm limited on brick. It's literally just random bulk buy um, inventory. That is all staying up there. That's going to be like my little DC area. So, yeah, let me know down below what you think. And then I'll see you in the next video. Bye.